Chris Brown, he asked, he has uh, 20 acres of hilly timber area with only one access point. He says, I get busted quite a bit because they can see me entry, see the entry from the next ridge. He said, did you have any, any uh, tips on sneaking in there? I'd probably um, um, wait for a very windy day. They can't see you very far on windy days because of uh, foliage moving around. Mm -hmm. um, otherwise, uh, hunt more mornings. So that they're not there watching you, getting there for the whole day. Yeah, that's a, that's a good tip. I don't know if a guy could go in there like this winter and try to make some path or something somewhere where you could be a little more hidden going in. I, that's that's rough whenever you only have that, that 20 acres isn't very big. Um, if, there's, if they got a vantage point, it's, it's tough. Try parking down the road. Maybe there's, you know, hearing you close your doors and stuff. Um, Going in really early helps too. Um, I think deer are kind of lethargic in midday. Mm -hmm. And if you just walk through and you, you don't try sneaking, they don't like sneaking. They, they know you're sneaking when you sneak. If you just walk in there like you own the place and then get around to where they can't see you and set up, and uh amount of time goes by they kind of forget about you yeah yep it is crazy how whenever you uh when a deer sees you from a ways off if you just keep walking real fast like they almost don't even they just sit there and watch you you know whereas if you I've start deer, like I've, I've had big bucks you walk by and you, out of your peripheral you see them bedded you know 20 yards from you yeah and if you don't stop and make eye contact they just lay there and let you pass. Oh, yeah. And that's not every deer. Someone no. will jump up when you're 100 yards away and take off. You know, yeah. Depending on uh, what life lessons they have learned over their time. Some of them have learned that just hunkering down is better for them. And some of them have learned that uh, getting out of Dodge is a good idea. But um, um, there are a lot of deer that will just let you just walk past. And I've actually had some deer where I've walked past them at a few yards. Yeah. And I, I think probably everybody listening to this, if you're an avid hunter, is at one time or another been walking through the woods, stopped, and all of a sudden a buck jumps up right beside him and takes yep. off. Well, if you had stopped, you wouldn't have took off. Yep. Happen, happened to me this year. Hey, everybody. If you like the channel, make sure you subscribe right here. And if you like the clips, i got two more options for you. Two options right here. Subscribe right here. See you guys.